We begin with that breaking news out of Holland that we've been following, where fire crews spent the entire afternoon putting out a house fire. Welcome to Western Mass News, everyone at 6. I'm Chris Pisano. And I'm Jordan Jagelinzer. State fire marshal investigators are now on scene. This as the cause of the fire draws attention to a common issue in homes during colder months. Western Mass News reporter Paris Dunford joins us live now in Holland with the details. Paris. Jordan and Chris, crews were called to this fire around noon today. Now, once they entered the home, they found the fire had started and the chimney. Tom Baltazar was sitting upstairs in his home on Sandy Beach Road in Holland on his computer when he noticed smoke. I saw some smoke, looked around, and I opened up one of the, the vents on the, on the side of the house and the fire broke out and said, OK, that's it. He was able to get his family members and animals out of the house and immediately called 911. He ran out of the house and it filled up with smoke in just a few minutes. I couldn't get back to get anything. Firefighters arrived on scene Friday afternoon around noon. This video was sent to us by one of the responders from the Holland Police Department. You can see thick billowing smoke and flames coming from the roof. When I arrived, we had light smoke puffing from the eaves. Firefighters from eight departments spent hours trying to put out the fire. Crews say the fire was trapped inside the walls of the home. They found heat in a uh, three-foot kick wall that was concealing the fire behind it. Holland Fire Chief James Gagney tells Western Mass News the fire started from the chimney. He says it's the first chimney fire of the season for his department, but he predicts it won't be the last. As the heat fluctuates and you have the warmer days with the colder days, the resin tends to build up inside the flues of the chimney and can prevent, uh, can actually cause a chimney fire. Gagney wants to remind homeowners with chimneys to have them professionally cleaned every year in order to prevent fires like this one from starting. Uh, when you're lighting them, obviously, you don't use accelerant fuels. You want everything to be organic or paper. The house was a total loss, but homeowner Stephen Gallo considers himself and his family very lucky. My uh, blessings is that it happened during the day. No one was asleep. Everyone got out safely. The dogs got out safely. And that's all that matters, really. Now crews are wrapped up around here around 3.30. Further investigation is being done by the state fire marshal's office. Reporting live, Paris Dunford for Western Mass News.